I've always been fascinated with what goes on behind the scenes of making movies. And for myself, it's always been common knowledge that when a movie is shot, they record the video and the audio separately and then match the two of them up in post. And that makes complete sense because, you know, they want to get the best possible quality from each one. But when I started shooting online videos for some strange reason, it never really dawned on me to record the audio separately. I've always just used the internal microphone on whatever camcorder or video recorder I was using. But the more I began to dissect my videos, the more I became picky about the overall quality. So recently, I got some advice from Gideon Shelwick. He's a well-known internet marketer who makes amazing quality YouTube videos. And Gideon recommended to use an external audio recorder to get top-notch quality. Now the recorder that he uses is called an Eddie Royal, I think it's pronounced. And although it has amazing sound quality, I couldn't resist going for the Zoom H4n. This thing had amazing reviews and with the extra features and only 20 bucks more, I couldn't pass it up. So if you compare the audio of this video to some of my past videos, then you can definitely hear the difference in the sound clarity. Now a professional audio recorder like this does come with a bit of a price tag. Uh, the Zoom cost me 300 bucks, but for the difference it made in my videos, I feel that it was well worth the price. And the type of mic that you use also makes a difference in your audio, but that depends on just how picky you are with sound. Uh, now, a lavalier mic, like what I'm using now, is probably your best choice. Now, what's great about a lavalier mic is that it gets right up close to the person speaking, so you can get really good quality. And as you can see, I haven't bothered hiding mine at all, but there are ways to conceal this mic a bit more. Now, Although these can also be a little pricey, you don't have to spend a lot of money for decent quality. The one that I'm using right now is called an Audio-Technica 3350, and I bought it off Amazon for 27 bucks. So for that price, you could afford to buy a couple extra for backup. And yes, just in case you're wondering, this is a wired mic, it's not wireless, but since I have it connected to my portable Zoom, then there's no reason for me to worry about long cords running across the floor. So for my entire audio setup, it's, it's fairly inexpensive for a professional level of sound. But this doesn't mean that you have to run out there and spend a few hundred bucks on audio equipment just so you can start shooting video. So just use your onboard mic for now. And as you continue to shoot more and more video, or if you're making money from your videos, then invest some of that money back into your equipment. Trust me, there's no rush. You know, we, we all gradually improve things as we grow online. And just getting yourself out there for now is really what matters. My name is Charles Rivera. Hopefully you got some good quality information out of this video. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video.